Hi, my name is Dina Meyer. I am representing Texas Alliance for Life. We are a statewide nonprofit organization of people dedicated to protecting innocent human life from conception through natural death using peaceful legal means. I am here to oppose the use of property tax money to pay for abortions, agenda item number nine. I see that you plan on discussing the women health, women's health services contracts in an executive session. I look forward to hearing your justification for excluding the public on this part of the meeting. The public deserves to hear the discussion on how their hard-earned money is going to be spent. For more than four years, the Travis County Health Care District has been forcing the taxpayers of Travis County to pay for abortions under the guise of women's health services. Already, almost two million of our tax dollars have been allotted to two abortion providers, Austin Women's Health Center and Whole Women's Health of Austin. Each contract states the purpose very clearly. I quote, the objective of this engagement is to provide pregnancy termination services to women enrolled in the medical assistance program or the state of Texas Medicaid program who live within Travis County. It can't get, get much clearer than that. These contracts are for abortions. Abortions take the lives of unborn children and, their, and they harm their mothers. Abortion is highly controversial and the funding of abortions by tax dollars is even more controversial. The federal government and the state government have spoken on the issue. They both forbid the use of federal and state tax dollars for abortions. Yet the Travis County Health Care District uses our taxes for this very reason. You have taken away the taxpayer's choice and violated their trust by doing so under the radar. You have been forcing taxpayers to pay for abortions for far too long. I'm sure many taxpayers in this county agree with me that it should stop now. I urge you not to re-enter into any contracts to provide abortions and do not use any more tax dollars to fund abortions. Thank you.